up these four jack stands up at the truck show in Sevierville. The two gray ones are 6,000 pound Sears. These other two are 7,000 pound. The one of them says Craftsman, the other one says MVP. But they're made exactly the same, so I picked up all four of them for twenty dollars. So I always need jack stands with projects in the driveway. This weekend, yard selling. Picked up this craftsman, old craftsman box, full of tools. It's got some Craftsman ranches. Uh, there's actually a lot of U.S. made sockets and got Stanley Professional half inch drive and a quarter inch drive that seem to be pretty good. Uh, this one old Craftsman ranch right here it's it just got craftsman right written right here at the end and the sizes on it is 7 16 and seventeen thirty seconds so I'd say that one's fairly old there are several of these stop you know double open in and here craftsman. there's a 13 sixteenths V series. This old ranch just says made in the USA. Don't even have a name. wood chisels and a package from a, a Hills department store which is a department store used to be around here a long time ago there's a proto large straight screwdriver you can see some of, like I said, some of it's China, some of it's decent stuff. That old ranch there is made in the USA. But I picked up the box and full of tools with the, with the tools for $25. It also had in these, uh, external Torx sockets they don't have a name on them it just says made in USA but my bet is they're Lyle but they appear to have never even been used so the other thing I picked up was this 66 Chilton's flat rate and parts manual it's in really good shape doesn't appear to be missing any pages any writing in on it you know it's just kind of a nostalgia thing uh, like I said I picked it up for 10 bucks and it's got all the OEM part numbers and stuff and what the parts cost back then. So it's kind of just neat to look at and see. So picked it up for 10 bucks at one yard sale. When I picked up that little tripod, it's a Sears uh, for a dollar at a yard sale. It was missing a sc screw from underneath that held them together, which I had one put it on. Uh, 
it seems to work out good I actually I tried it out I did, you know using it under a car <laughs> worked all right I think it'd be a handy little thing to have especially for a butt appreciate y'all watching hope y'all had, had a good weekend me and my wife were riding around Sunday through some small country roads after church come across this snapped a picture I thought I'd just share it with y'all it's kind of a neat old piece thank you